Louisiana Living with Ashley Doughty on Fox 14. All right, it's always a pleasure to have Jerrica Bennett here. No, it is not Thursday. It is only Tuesday, but she is here earlier this week, and she's going to tell us about all the weekend events. We're going to have some mm -hmm. bad weather, so hopefully there's some inside. Yeah, bad weather, but good news, because all of these events that I have for you today are inside. Good so job. definitely a good way to get away from the bad weather and the places that you can stay warm in. Um, but we do have lots of stuff going on, and I honestly think it's never too early to start thinking about your weekend plan. Sometimes it helps sure. you get through the rest of the week. So. <laughs> I always get in a good mood when I see Jerry. It's like, almost the weekend. Yeah, we're talking about the weekend. So um, there's tons of stuff going on. Uh, the first thing is a January book discussion that's going to be happening at the Spice and Tea Exchange, which is on Antique Alley, which is something kind of different, but they take, like, recipe books, um, that are going mm -hmm. on uh, and they'll take them and kind of go through them and you have like a group discussion with it. Uh, the that. title of this book that they're doing for this month is called Recipes for Love and Murder by Sally Andrew. Mm -hmm. So definitely interesting. interesting. <laughs> you want to pay attention yeah. to that one. Make sure you <laughs> aim for the first part, not the second part. <laughs> Um, also, the Washtenaw Parish uh, Public Library is doing tween bingo at the um, Washtenaw Valley branch, so that will be something Cute. fun. Mm -hmm. Again, an age group that's not usually, you know, has a specific event for it, but you've got uh, 9 to 12-year-olds. They'll be hosting a fun bingo event for all of them to come and hang out, so that's always something fun. Absolutely. Um, of course, Ag Expo is this weekend. I've been seeing ads for it everywhere, but I just love this event. So it's uh, so many things combined, uh, agriculture, education, you will learn a lot, but they also have a mini farm there where you might get to yeah. hold some little chicks or pet some cows. Um, and then they also have local vendors come out there. So you'll see like Landry Vineyards and some local beekeepers out there with their honey and stuff like that. So lots of good opportunities to kind of see some of the local fare and hang out with some cool animals, cute animals. Really definitely learn a lot about agriculture in your mm -hmm. area. Yeah. And it's fun. It's fun for the whole family. It is. It's a good family event. That'll be Friday and Saturday, so all weekend. Um, guest chef Chris Sherrill will be at Miss K's this weekend, so he'll be doing kind of a a uh, unique, different dinner. Well, they'll be serving uh, a special menu, and uh, seating is limited, so you'll have to reserve your spot to get there. Okay. Also, this weekend is a friction fighting championship yeah. at Monroe Civic Center, so that'll be something fun to go out and check out some uh, professional and amateur wrestling. So. Um, that's what I'm That'll going be fun. to. Yeah. <laughs> it's actually a lot well, of fun. I didn't know what to expect the first time, but I enjoyed it. Uh huh. It is something fun yeah. and cool to go out and do. And a lot of the people are local for that as well. So that's something fun to go and support. Uh, the Master Gardener uh, January Gardening Seminar is happening at the West Monroe Convention uh, Center. So that you'll have an opportunity to go out and kind of start getting ready for spring and check out some of the stuff they have. They'll be giving you tips on how to grow things and That'll be something fun to go to. And then on Sunday, the Brass Band Concert is happening at um, ULM's Brown Auditorium. So something okay. to do just about every day this weekend. Something to do mm -hmm. all inside, which is wonderful. Mm -hmm. And uh, Jerrica, what is your website address where somebody can go onto it and check out all these events? You can visit us at monroe-westmonroe.org. All right. Thank you so much for joining us. Great to see you. Mm -hmm. And have a great rest of the week and yes. a great weekend. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and coming up next, we'll tell you how Martin Luther King's Day of Service is being celebrated. So stay with us.